Hello everyone and welcome for another short video about HLA. Again, this is Ahmad Mustafa coming to you again. And today we are going to focus on the structure of HLA. And from the figure here, you can see that we have two different classes of HLA, HLA class one and HLA class two. So let's see, or let's focus first on the HLA class one. From the figure here, you can see that the HLA class one is formed of two molecules. The alpha chain, which is formed of different subunit, the alpha one, the alpha two, the alpha three, the transmembrane complex, and then the cytoplasmic tail. And then the second molecule here is the beta two microglobulin. So in the world of HLA, and what we do in the HLA lab, we only do typing for the alpha chain of the class one. We never do the typing of the beta two microglobulin. And the reason for that, because the beta two microglobulin is the same for all the individuals. So if I did typing for my beta two microglobulin, it will be very similar to yours beta two microglobulin. But the alpha chain is very polymorphic uh, chain. And that's why we focus on the HLA typing for the alpha chain. And the, the up till now or up to, to 2024, there are almost over 35 different HLA class one alleles. And here you can see that the, the, th the major three genes for the HLA class one are the HLA A, the HLA B, and the HLA C. And then the other thing here from the, 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 the diagram, you can see that the HLA class one is, is completely different than the HLA class two. The HLA class two is formed of two molecules or two chains, the alpha chain and the beta chain. And the, the other thing here, which I wanna focus about is the peptide binding groove. And you can see that both the class one and the class two has a peptide binding groove. And from the figure, you can see that the peptide binding group for the, uh, for the class one is completely different than the peptide binding group for the class two. And I'm going to explain it in, later on in other presentation, what's the importance of the different peptide binding group. But for the class two, you can see that the class two is formed of, or there are three uh, main genes for the class two, the HLA-DR, the HLA-DQ, and the HLA-DP. Now, we already talked that we only do typing for the alpha chain, but let's talk more about what we do typing for the class two, because it's a little bit different with every gene. So if we, we talk about the HLA-DR, we only do typing for the beta chain for the DR, and we never do typing for the uh, alpha chain, because the alpha chain is, is kind of monomorphic, or at least they might be like two to five different proteins, but they are not clinically significant in the world of transplantation. But the beta chain, we do typing for the beta chain, and there are different types of beta chain, which I'm going to explain it in, a, in a different short video. But on the other hand, for the HLA-DQ and the HLA-DP, we do typing for both the alpha chain and the beta chain. And because both in both scenarios, the DQ and the DP, both the alpha chain and the beta chain are um, uh, polymorphic and both of them are very clinical significant. Thank you and we'll see you again in another, another short video.